Hi, welcome back to my channel. This is Psychic Medium Raymond Guzman, and this is your monthly horoscope forecast for the sign of Leo for the month of August 2018. Welcome back to my channel. If this is the first time that you're tuning into my channel, please go ahead and take some time to hit the red subscribe button on the bottom right hand corner of this video, as well as the notification bell icon so that way you can be notified of any future videos that I publish. That being said and done, let's go ahead and get into your horoscopes for this month. So for you, Leo, a lot of you out there this month could be really uh, in a good place financially, more strength, uh, more time to spend some of your money, your hard-earned money, and really just practicing self-love for yourself. That's what it boils down to this month. And it feels like your whole life in general is balanced this month. You feel like you're a little bit more, you know, stable in your emotions and your clear thinking. Uh, your spiritual senses are heightened, but they're very balanced. Uh, and so you, it's almost like the world is all you know, just everyone in the world is vibrating towards you, uh, gravitating towards you. And it could be, you know, that you are just very well liked. Your personality is magnetic. So there's a lot of good things that are happening this month for you in all these areas of your career, your family, your friendships, and all those connections and networking that you're doing. There is something that worries you later in the month, and this could be something that's not directly involving you, but perhaps a male in your life. And there is some type of betrayal that is going on with this male by another person. This could be uh, it's another male. And it could be somebody that just doesn't like them or has a, a, you know, a vendetta against them. But there's something that where there is a betrayal and they basically need to be very cautious or at least have a level of awareness. Now, this is um, this, you know, horoscope reading is not meant to bring any kind of fear into this just to create an awareness. So I'm just putting that out there that, you know, if you do have a male in your life who is very stressed or emotionally not stable right now and is going through a lot because of. Uh, backstabbing of a friend or a family member, you know, out there, just let them know that it's going to be okay. They just need to have their level of awareness and not trust this person. Um, you know, that saying that goes, once a person shows you their true colors, you believe them the first time, you know, so just kind of believe that and don't fall for, you know, into the trap that, that they have changed necessarily, because I, again, I get a lot of deception around that. Um, and so they may need to spend some time alone. That male in your life may need to spend some time alone, really meditating and really, you know, asking themselves, you know, what is the next step that they want to take with this? Now, a lot of you out there, Moonchilds, um, you may also be finding that your your spiritual connection to the other side in particular is a uh, very much heightened and very strong. And I mentioned that earlier in this reading for the horoscopes. So a lot of spirits could be coming to you in your dreams. You may be feeling or sensing spirits around you. And this is not something negative, but rather than them protecting you from the other side and letting you know that all of your hard works hard work is paying off and that there is a reward for you in some kind of manner, whether this is a promotion, an increase in your pay, but there is some kind of reward and it doesn't have to be monetary in nature. It can just be, you know, more of a, you know, someone recognizing you for your, you know, your compassion and your loyalty to your friendships and your friends. So just be, you know, be accepting of anything that somebody wants to do for you. Be open and just embrace it. Um, but later in the month, you know, as you get to the end of the month, it could be feeling like you are now entering into a new area of your life. This could be a, another job or some, you know, some other area of your life, whether this is a skill or something else that you're doing that kind of seems a little foreign to you, something that may not feel very familiar to you. So you have a lot of insecurities or doubts whether or not you're going to be able to make it to the other side of that and just, you know, kind of feel a little bit more solidified and more validated in that area. And you will, you will get there. So just be patient, know that you are on the right path and you are heading in the right direction. And this could also be speaking about moving. Uh, Spirit, you know, says that this month for a lot of you Leos out there could be finding that this is going to be a very powerful month to move locations, whether this is in your same city or across the, the country or to another state. But there is a lot of plans of traveling and moving 
this month for many of you Leos out there that this would apply to. So I want to thank you so much for tuning in. If you did like this video, please be sure to give it a thumbs up. Also, be sure to follow me on Facebook and Instagram. And if you would like to set up a private reading with me, you can go to my website. That's www.raymondguzman.net forward slash shop. Blessings and love and light. Have an amazing month.